Hey guys, welcome back. So today I just want to do a little mini haul. I got a package from ColourPop and I also went to Ulta and I went to Target but I just got like a tank top and then these sunglasses. Story behind these sunglasses. So I went to Hawaii for my sister's wedding and I don't know if any of you guys have ever been to Hawaii but or really the ocean in general, the waves are ridiculous. They are humongous. And so I didn't really want to go in the water one day and my boyfriend picked me up and like dragged me out to the water and I was just like, oh my gosh, <sighs> like whatever. Then as though his back was to the wave and I was facing the wave, this huge wave like just smashed as I thought that he saw the wave so I thought like that was on purpose. Totally wasn't. And these sunglasses were sitting up on my head like this and so I got up and was like, oh my god, I didn't drown. And my glasses were gone, oh my gosh. I was like, I was so distraught. These are my favorite sunglasses and they were gone and when I went to Target today, I found them. So, you know, I had to repurchase them. They're kind of different from my normal style, but I think they're cute with like the tortoise shell outside, no? Whatever, I like them, I think they're cute. We will start with Ulta. I only got a couple things from Ulta. I wasn't doing this humongous shopping trip today. But the first thing that I really went there to find is the NYX eyeshadow in Mermaid. It's the prismatic eyeshadow. Here's what it looks like in the pan. So I picked up this eyeshadow mainly because I just subscribed to Samantha Lopez and she did a tutorial using this eyeshadow and it was beautiful. Like, I loved it. And she has kind of the same complexion as me, um, kind of a medium tone with dark eyes and so I thought that if she can pull it off, I can pull it off. And she looked amazing in the tutorial so I had to get it. Also, Allison Henry just posted a selfie with this on her lids as well this morning. I was already planning on going to pick it up anyways but it just made me want it even more, so it worked. Okay, so here's the color in the pan. These are so pigmented, like it's ridiculous how pigmented these are. And here is a swatch of it. That's like, that's amazing. Okay, so I picked mine up from Ulta and it retails for $6. Um, I really want to do a tutorial using this eyeshadow, so if you think I should, please comment down below. Also, if there are other recommendations you guys have for these prismatic shadows, leave them down below. I love like the bronzy, really all of them, like just all of them. If you love them, comment down below which one I should get. The second thing I picked up from Ulta is the new Lorac Pro Matte Palette. Um, I've seen this in a few tutorials I've watched as well from Miss Tiffany K. I love her. She's the bomb. Tiffany, if you ever see this, I love you. But I picked this up from Ulta as well. I believe it was $28, which honestly isn't that bad. So you get, like, oh, I haven't even opened it. Ah, it's so cute. Look how little it is. It's so cute. This came on top of everything. You get eight rock shadows. And can we just, oh, these are like perfect. These are right up my freaking alley. I love these. This is what the palette looks like if you have not seen it yet. They are amazing. Lurac has some of the best quality eyeshadows that I've ever used. I love them. Does anybody else not like swatching things because you feel like you're just going to mess up how pretty it is? So here are the swatches. Those are actually really pigmented. And for only 28 bucks, this is like a steal, man. So if you guys see this in your Ulta, I definitely think you should pick it up. Um, I like that they're all pretty neutral shades, but... They're not all like brown tone. I mean, don't get me wrong, burgundy is kind of a brown tone shade, but the mauve and the burgundy, like you could do so many looks with just this palette. It's amazing. So for 28 bucks, little rock, you the bomb. That's all that I got from Ulta and now I'm gonna open my ColourPop and I'm so excited. So this is what it came in. I didn't get many things. Um, just because, I don't know, like, I'm so weird about money. Like, I'm just weird about it. I don't know, do they write, like, handwritten things for everything? This is the cutest thing I maybe have ever seen in my entire life. It also comes with, I think, like, directions and stuff like that on how to use these. So, I got one lippy stick in the cup, in the color, I want to say pinch. Yeah. So, I got one lippy stick in the color pinch. It is a matte lippy stick, and I could not find the matching lippy pencil, so this one might not come with it. Which is kind of weird. It's so cute. Look at it. It's so cute. Okay. 
And this is what it looks like in the package. This is beautiful. I love it. I think I'm going to get Yeah. So it is matte. I did get one of the matte ones. I don't know if I said that before. But, oh my god, I love this. I'm going to reach for this all the time. This will definitely be like my go-to nude. The show. And I also got an ultra matte lip cream. Or ultra matte lip. I don't know. In the color. I think, I'm pretty sure I got it in trap. Because that is the one I wanted. Yes, I got it in trap. Ooh. This is what the package looks like. So cute, so cute. So this is what Trap looks like on. I love this. I think it is so cute. Um, I like how it feels on my lips. Oh. And it doesn't come off. These are like the greatest. I'm going to have to get definitely some more in these. So the last two things that I did purchase from ColourPop are two of their Super Shock Shadows. I got the color Lala and the color Lovely. I was in need of some more lid colors and I really wanted to try these because I just feel like some of the lid colors I use just are not super pigmented and oh, these are just beautiful. So Lala is the rose gold one and Lovely is the more champagne-y, not champagne, well, yeah, I guess like a champagne -y gold kind of color. Um, the, sh the champagne -y gold kind of color is a bit more chalky. I feel like Lala was definitely more smooth. I will definitely be reaching for these. Lala, probably more so. Um, I love this rose gold kind of color. I do not have anything even remotely similar to this in my own collection. So this will definitely get reached for a lot. A lot, a lot. Extremely, extremely happy with all the things that I bought, especially the ColourPop stuff. I might have to get on their website here soon. Big! I'm extremely excited about all the ColourPop things that I purchased. I will definitely be purchasing some more from them soon. Like, very, very soon. Like, maybe within the next, like, couple days soon. Yeah, for sure. If you guys have any recommendations for more ColourPop products, please put them down below. This concludes my video, the very first kind of sort of haul that I'm ever doing, and hopefully I'll get to do more. Please give this a thumbs up if you do like haul videos, and thank you for watching. Please subscribe if you haven't, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.